can't let you. I'm doing this for you karmically as well as for me. You cannot take my baby. You wouldn't repossess an actual baby, would you? Look, I don't sleep that much. You know what? I, I don't care! <laughs> I'm hooked. I'm hooked already. <laughs> We're talking about Wild Honey, a romantic comedy starring Rusty Schwimmer was last night's opening night film kicking off this year's Sunscreen Film Festival, which goes all the way through this weekend in St. Petersburg. Rusty joins me now along with festival founder and film commissioner Tony Armour. Wild Honey, tonight you're in town for the big unveiling. That looks so good. Thank you so much. I'll give you the $20 later. Deal. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> okay. So I got to see the preview. The film aired last night. Mm -hmm. People laughing out loud. I mean, even just a chuckle from how much fun is it to be able to do a comedy like this? And, and what would you like people to know about it? Well, what I love about it is, is that I'm the leading lady. I'm like, you're Emma Stone, you're Meg Ryan, <laughs> uh, going through uh, a, a nice little romance and, uh, uh, you know, crazy things, antics that happen. But I love the fact that uh, a woman like me can represent uh, most women in America. So they get to see a film about themselves. I mean, absolutely. You're relatable seeing the car being, you know, repoed and you're begging not for it to happen there. What does that say, though, as an actress? I mean, you kind of touched on it a little bit, and Hollywood can be tough, and you always think yeah. of the young girls being the leading ladies. Sure, sure. So that's got to be, you kind of touched on how fulfilling it is. It is fulfilling. I think that, uh, I think that most of American women are really, really hungering and thirsting for someone to look like them on film mm -hmm. and that's what I'm here for. I wish we'd uh, see more of it too. Uh, you're gonna see more of it I think. Oh. I think you really are. Well yeah. speaking of things we can see more of what else is going on? This is again <laughs> one of those film festivals that everybody has circled on their calendar. Yeah no it's great you know 13th year hard to believe we've, we're at 13 years now but 131 films over the course of the weekend short films and feature films and documentaries and a, and a little bit of everything Saturday night a, a really fun film called All Square and another one um, uh, Butterfly Kisses a little horror thriller and like I said lots of great shorts and everything workshops parties I mean you can't uh, a little something for everybody. You know, there's such a, a film world, if you will, that I've gotten to know more of through Tony, and I'm assuming you have, you know, as an actress. Mm -hmm. Being able to come to these film festivals, why do you enjoy that? I enjoy it because I like to s see the people that I'm actually playing, that mm -hmm. I'm actually portraying, so I can do it correctly. Uh, I love all the people that I meet in every city, every town. People, uh, to me, are fun. <laughs> I'll say, you seem fun. You are fun, I can tell. She is. We've been hanging out for the last couple hours, driving around, doing our thing, and yeah. it's, we're having a good time. We're having a good time. I can't complain. I get to play dress up for a living. Come on. I'll right. say, and that's kind of what I say I get to do. I get to dress up, yep. put on the face and everything. Mm -hmm. Tony, from a community standpoint, what does these film festivals, what do they do for the Tampa Bay area? Yeah, well, a lot of things. You know, one, from a, from a tourism standpoint, we have people flying in from all over the world to attend this uh, festival. So at least 75 of the films have filmmakers flying in from South America and Europe and a little bit of everywhere else. You know, it's a great um, promotional thing for the area, just kind of showcasing who we are and what we can do. There's not a lot of film festivals that make it to 13 years, only right. something like 2 or 3% even make it to year 10. So we're in a, a very small group of festivals that That's have been able huge. to last this long. And well, a congratulations then for the Big 13, and a congratulations on your film. Again, looks hilarious. Thank, thank you, you for coming in today. Keep it going. Go ahead, get your tickets now. Sunscreen Film Festival all weekend long. Go out and check out some films for yourself.